Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So it's season 42, and this is war number 8. And we're going up against an alliance called Sparta Revolution. Revolution! Let's see who they've banned. Okay, I like y'all. Didn't ban Gallon. Um, let's take a look there. Okay, doesn't really bother me. Um, as you can see, no one's gone in yet. I will probably be the first one to go in. <laughs> plans, plans. All right, so I take path three in sections one and two. No defender on that first node. That'll be an easy fight. Uh, and then we've got infamous Iron Man. Now, I know from fighting him so many times, he gets an armor up. And on this node, that's gallon food. Yeah. Yummy. All right. Um, Mangog, hmm. he's got counters, you know, we'll, we'll see what we got left over here. And there's my favorite fight. No, I do not like this fight. However, I can take it, which I have, uh, with Magneto and they did not ban Magneto. And look at this, Penny Parker. Now, I don't believe her sync shield counts as an armor up. Um, that'd be really bad if it does, because I can take Gallon in here. Gallon is not bleed immune. So if she does get an armor up, Gallon will bleed to death. Um, there's Nimrod and Omega Sentinel. Both can be taken out by Nebula. So... Um, I'll I'll just make sure that her armor up doesn't count, but if it does, I mean her uh sync shield doesn't count as an armor. And if it doesn't, then Gallon can take this fight. If it does, then Nebula can probably take this fight. So Nebula, Gallon, and Magneto is what it's looking like. And I'll be able to take two of the minis. So that's the idea. Let's see over here. Um, I, I'll probably just let them tell me if there's anyone on my team that looks like they could take one of these. I don't see anyone right off that anyone that I am bringing could do this. Yeah, I don't see anyone right off. All right, enough planning. Let's get on with the fighting. All right, so here we go. We've got Gallon, we've got Nebula, and we've got Magneto. And I'm gonna be taking two of the minis on the left side, which gives my Alliance mates more options to help out on Boss Island. And let me tell you, this war, very, very close war, okay? Uh, these guys are good, and we are fighting. All right, now, first one is Infamous Iron Man. Not too worried about him. Not on this path, not with Gallon. Uh, if Gallon had been um, banned, I would have taken somebody else, but um, Gallon is going to be the best if anyone that gets armor ups is placed on this path. Um, Namor, also a very, very good option. All right, so you can see here my planetary mass is going up like crazy. I don't have any way to um, armor break him, but I don't need to. But that happens. I was When that happened to me, I was like, really? You just had to get that last lick in, huh? Didn't matter whether he had his armor uh, aura up or anything like that. He was going down. But he just had to hit me. Had to hit me. And I'm just like, okay, I was ready to evade that. But it caught me. And I didn't uh, dash back fast enough. But in any case, we got him down. Now, I did not take this Mangog. Uh, I left that to... Uh, one of my alliance mates. They did very, very well. 
Got that uh, Mangog down. And as you can see, there's four hours left. It's the next day. Okay, I actually went through, as you saw, uh, used up my energy. And then uh, next day, um, I think it was around 10 or so, uh, finished eating my breakfast so that I was nice and, and full and all. And now we're going to take this Ant-Man. Now, you guys remember when I fought this Ant-Man uh, in a previous war, right? I learned. I learned. Okay. Still got this Magneto. But watch how this fight goes compared to my other one. Same Magneto. All right. See how I um, parried and waited for the mag uh, magnetism to hit him? That's something that I needed to learn to do. Thanks, Jay Will. Uh, Jason and Jabari Gaming left a comment and uh, let me know to do that. You know, wait for the magnetism because it takes a little bit before it actually hits. All right, but just look at this. All right, he has the uh, regen, but do you see his health? The regen triggered, but that was it. He's shut down. And right there, I just messed up. I held it too long. I was too busy looking up, uh, and I wasn't paying attention. And look at this, just getting smacked up, but it's not hurting that much because he's magnetized. All right. I, I may take uh, Magneto up to rank four, but for now, this rank three is doing okay. Okay. Um, just look at this. So at this point, I'm feeling pretty confident. All right. Uh, look at this. I got 39. And I'm like, even if he hits me, I'm good, right? So I blocked all of that. And I was already at 40. So there we go. And he is going to be toasty. So that was pretty easy. Way better than the first time I faced him. I learn. I get better. And uh, that went nice and smooth. Magneto does not need to be ranked four to function. All right. Now we've got Penny Parker. And you already know who I'm going to use against Penny Parker. Uh, I found out that it does not count as an armor up. You know, all of that right there. Um, so we're good. Okay. Look at this. Now, I like um, Hulkling better when uh, fighting with Penny, but Gallon is also very good. See all that? Look at my planetary mass because of that. Just look at that. So now I just got to parry, heavy, bam, Sparta, tune, done. Very good counters to Penny, Gallon and Hulkling. Uh, if I see Penny again, again there and Gallon is not available, I'll go with Hulkling. Um, Hulkling can also take the next node. So that would, you know, work out really well. All right. So we've got Omega Sentinel. And I actually could have taken her with uh, Magneto. The magnetism should shut stuff down. But I wasn't going to chance it. Better to just go in with Nebula, who can shut her down and is shock immune. Now, what you saw there happens all the time. It is very annoying. Um, it is a problem with the new input system. I did not have this problem on the old input system. And ever since the beta, that has been a, an issue. And it's always the same. It's always when they're firing a heavy attack or a special when I'm close. And it's not all the time, which drives me insane. Okay. We were able to get her down pretty easily, but that is so annoying because you swipe back and there are people now, you know, it was hard for me to try to prove that I swiped. You know, you'd have to record yourself all the time. Maybe turn on that feature where you could see the swipes happening. Well, somebody did that. They recorded it, and we could see the swipe, and we saw the character stand there and get hit. 
So we know it's a thing. Now, check this out. You guys remember the high energy diet issue, right? At this point, I went, uh-oh. Because I had planned to go in with Nebula. Nebula on high energy diet. Really? Shock. And I'm like, oh, don't tell me I did this again. So I went back and I said, okay, we might have a little problem. Uh, I know Gallon can do it, but, you know, uh, I won't be able to use Nebula. And uh, I believe I can't use Magneto because he does energy. So Gallon is the only one I have that can do this. But there's a strategy to using uh, Gallon uh, on here. First of all, you need to have an advanced power boost. Okay? And you cannot use the special two, only your special one. Special one is not energy damage, okay? So that's what I'm doing here. You also do not want a dex, all right? This node punishes when you have buffs and they expire, okay? So you notice I'm just parrying, not backing off. This right here, taking it all into the block, okay? Just, just parry, bam. And I thought this was gonna be enough, with the special one, almost 17, 17%. And you can see here, that's a lot of damage into my block, but nothing compared to if I had actually gotten hit by it. All right, so I waited out that unstoppable. And now look at my, look at my um, power. I'm not gonna get to another special one. Uh, that special one, if I had built up more, could have taken him out, but we got him down just hitting him because Gallon's attacks, his basic attacks, are not energy. So he can definitely work uh, on this particular node. Uh, it's just a little tricky, a little tricky. Um, even if I had not gone in with the advanced power one, uh, there's no telling whether I would have survived long enough, you know, taking a lot of the block damage. Um, it would have been a longer fight for sure. All right. Uh, that is it for my participation in this war. Again, this is a very, very close war. Uh, and we'll be back and you'll find out how this war ended. And we're back. Unfortunately, we lost this war so close. Look at the score, guys. Look at the score. That is what? 160 points. Take a look. Two attack bonuses. We lost by two attack bonuses. Very, very close war. All right. Congratulations to Spotter. That is a well-fought war. All right. So anyway, that is going to do it for the video. Take care. Hit the like button. It helps me out, helps me grow. And you all have a blessed day. Thank you.